This is Eric. Today is July the 25th, 2023. And in this video, we will be resolving some questions on the history of Brazil, particularly the coming of the Portuguese royal family to Brazil. And the first question says, In 1806, the French Emperor Napoleon Bonaparte announced the continental blockade of England, establishing that no European country could trade with the British. The King of Portugal, pressured by the liberal wave of the French Revolution and supported by England, fled to the Portuguese colony in America to wait for the situation to normalize. And the question is, regarding the presence of the Portuguese royal family in Brazil, it is correct it is in capital letters, okay, guys? It is correct to state that the Farroupilha Revolution... No, wait, this, this is going to take place further, right? During the Regency period. So this one is definitely wrong. I don't even have to read it. Salvador was elevated to the status of capital of the United Kingdom of Portugal and Algarves. No, actually, Rio de Janeiro was elevated to the status of capital, right? So this one is wrong. The presence of the Portuguese court in Brazil exercising an absolutist and conservative government contributed to delayed the independence of Brazil. No, uh, neither did it contribute to a delay in the independence of Brazil, uh, nor... Uh, did the Portuguese court exercise an absolutist and conservative government? Okay, so this one is also wrong. As soon as he arrived in Brazil, Dom João VI immediately tried to fulfill his promise to the British and decreed the opening of the ports in 1808 for friendly nations to trade directly with the colony. Yes, that is correct. Absolutely true. Right, uh, literally, Don Juan and Portugal were were in the hands of England. Right, yeah. So this is the correct answer. Second question: um, uh, State University of Serra. So it says, then came the mother of Don Juan in her seventy six, sorry, in her seventy three years old, Queen Maria I. They say that when a carriage ran towards the docks, she would have shouted, Don't go so fast, or don't go so fast. They would think we're running away. And that's exactly what they were doing. But anyway, upon reaching the port, she would have refused to go down. And the question is, the episode narrated above is related to the escape of the Portuguese royal family to the Brazilian colony. Yes, they were fleeing from... Napoleon Bonaparte, as we read in the previous question, right? So, uh, this episode was, you know, <laughs> it narrates a pretty funny, I would say funny at a time, you know, or occasion in the history of Portugal. But let's continue here. And our last question is from the Getulio Vargas Foundation. Uh, and it says, the first important measure taken by the Prince Regent after his arrival was the April 1st, 1808 permit. The key purpose of the Legislative Act was to promote the industrialization of Brazil. Some important incentives were granted through the April 28th, 1809 permit. Exemption from export tax for national manufactured products mandatory use of national goods by the royal troops and the annual distribution of 60,000 cruzeiros among industrialists in the weaving of cotton, wool, and silk. And the question. Considering the information in the text and knowledge about the transfer of the Portuguese court to Brazil, it can be said that the government promoted the industrialization of the country, charging high taxes on goods imported from England. No, actually, they made it they made it easy for the products coming from England. 
uh, sought to expand the internal consumer market, gradually abolishing the exploitation of slave labor. No way. As a matter of fact, slavery in Brazil will go on for a long, long time and will only be abolished uh, near the next, the following century. So this one is wrong as well. Uh, developed the arms industry with the aim of expelling Bonapartist troops from the Portuguese, sorry, there's an article missing here, from the Portuguese territory. Uh, no, 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 that's definitely wrong. Uh, th there, there were no uh, Bonapartist troops here in Brazil. <laughs> if, if there were Bonapartist troops in Brazil, you know, Portugal, the, the, Port the Portuguese uh, court would never have escaped to Brazil, right? Aimed at equipping the colony as the center of the empire enabling economic policies contrary to colonial statute, statutes. Yes, yes, the coming of the, of the Portuguese royal family to Brazil and all the court uh, in this context uh, allowed, uh, you know, the, uh, allowed the colony to, um, to move away, you know, from this status of a colony that was there only to feed the metropolis. No. Now uh, we have here the colony being equipped as a center of the empire, right? Well, so this is it for now, guys. I hope you have enjoyed these exercises and I hope to see you as well in, uh, in our next video. Thank you so much.